If more lawmakers are implicated in the bribery scandal that is tied to Jay Kalani English and Ty Cullen, it's likely that federal investigators have already questioned some of the likely suspects. Otherwise, legal experts say federal investigators would not be talking about the ongoing investigation. Manolo Morales follows up. Federal prosecutors spoke openly on Thursday that they asked for a reduced sentence for Ty Cullen, seen here on the right, because of his substantial cooperation with an ongoing investigation. Legal experts say that cooperation means investigators are looking into more lawmakers who have accepted bribes or donors or both. Defense attorney Megan Cow, who is not involved in the case, says the feds have probably communicated with the potential suspects. In my experience, it also means that person has already come in to talk with the federal agencies or with the federal agents and is either cooperating him or herself or is going to enter into a guilty plea. Kyle points out that the feds rarely talk about an ongoing investigation unless they're that close to getting the suspect. There's been some communication between that defendant and that defendant or that defendant's attorney. Lawmakers say whatever the outcome, the important thing now is to pass laws to prevent any legislators from doing it again. Among the proposals moving forward is the public financing bill, which is being hailed by the watchdog group Common Cause. The voters have had enough of the high profile scandals that have been plaguing the Hawaii Capitol and some of their local governments for a long time. And this bill is the fix to many of those problems. The bill allows a candidate to raise campaign money in a different way that prevents big contributions from private donors. The bill has passed both the Senate and the House, but will likely get more scrutiny before the end of the session. Manolo Morales, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.